What's going on? Look at the stack. What were you there for? I'm Neil Mushroom, and today we're playing some High Power Commander because uh, sometimes we play High Power, sometimes we play Budget. And um, I will go first, but I think it'd be really cool if Foley explained what this partner pairing of Commanders did in today's High Power Commander EDH game, just chill to video. Uh, High Guile's here to add blue to the deck, and Warnog's here to flicker him, well, not flicker himself, but get flickered, and hopefully assemble some sort of combo. How annoying is, how annoyed are you that Candlekeep Sage does, can't be partnered with uh, Vernog? Wouldn't Very. Candlekeep Sage just be better? It would. It, just, would. Yeah, it would. <laughs> it would just be better. Yeah. Candlekeep Sage is the best. But what does your deck do? Um, it is trying to basically assemble a combo with either KCI and Eldrazi Displacer, or Time Sieve, or... Your Esper combo. Esper, your Esper artifact combos. Um, and Warnog's just trying to be a value engine. Very cool. Well, speaking of Esper, what if you got rid of the worst colors in the pairing, which are white and black, and you added the color red? Then you'd have Veyran, Voice of Duality, a 2-2 uh, two -two, free Wizard for three mana with Magecraft that says whenever you cast or copy an instant or sorcery spell, Veyran, Voice of Duality, gets plus one plus one until the turn. Uh, th this next ability is important. If casting or copying an instant or sorcery spell causes a triggered ability of a permanent to trigger, you, uh, it triggers an additional time. So Veyron has like double prowess, which is pretty neat. And Veyron also makes things like uh, Tim's, the cards that sit in play and deal damage whenever you cast into our sorcery, it does it twice. Um, so we're playing a take on Curious Control. We've got a bunch of Curiosity effects and a bunch of Tim effects, and we're gonna use that to draw cards. And at the end of the day, we're a combo deck, but our combo pieces are typically gonna be Storm Kill Artist and Haze Bridge. Uh, which nets you infinite mana and infinite everything. Um, it's really cool. If you've never seen it, um, it involves Magecraft. And if you see it, you'll see it. If not, check out this card to a video of Varan doing just that thing. Calvin. Oh, I'm playing Rafine Scheming Seer. Um, I'm trying to be an Esper uh, Stacks deck, I'm putting stacks like Thalia's into play in order to slow down my opponents and then otherwise uh, turning sideways and putting big fatties into the graveyard to reanimate them. This isn't an aristocrat's build, this is like properly I'm trying to put like ginormous creatures like Elish Norn or Toxrill into play. Uh, I hate it. Tip the like actual old school reanimator because when you connive, you draw X and discard X. Wow. But, well, then. I'm playing Acerac, the Arch Lich. It's a mono black combo deck, tries to combo with him, reduces mana cost, to make him cheap, and just dungeon out. Something you're familiar with. It's so good. You're not the way you're dungeoning isn't the same. No. You just dungeons the flavor you put on what happens when you make this thing have a seizure infinitely. <laughs> it could be anything. You could you could also just have an altar of the brood and plane be yeah. there too. Yeah. So uh, it's pretty gross. We've seen Acer Acer Egg before. It's a busted commander. It's really cool. Um, is everyone ready to play card game? Yeah. Yeah. I'm ready to play card game. My hand's funky and like maybe not good, but I get to play a new card, so I'm keeping it. That sounds good. Is everyone ready? Three. One, three, five, flip, go. I got the chocobo. It's me. I'm the chicken. I'm the chocobo. I get to go first. That's that's how it works, right? Yeah. All right. I have a keep. Like I said, it's gonna seem fast. Don't don't. No one panic. Is everyone ready? Yeah. It, it the man is fast, but that's about it. And that's a brain freeze. I brain freeze. I was wondering what I would pitch to this Chromox. I'm gonna pitch brain freeze to Chromox. Yeah. <laughs> And I'm gonna play Flooded Strand, and I'm gonna fetch and shock for Esteem Vents, and play Arcane Signet. That yeah. is it. One, two, three. Okay, I'm gonna draw. I'm gonna play a Swamp, and that's all I got. Past. Okay. I also have a kind of fast turn, so just don't worry about it. Here's a Rafine's Tower in tap. Nice. <laughs> you lying. Oh, Wait, I wasn't done. I'm kidding, I was done. Okay. <laughs> I have more to do. Uh, what happened to your leg? I am going to shock in this Godless Shrine. Beep, beep. Uh, but then I'm going to pay two life to Catachian Pro Adrian. Yeah, absolutely. Um, here's this. Whee! Oh, I get it. <laughs> what do you get? See. Is Brain Freeze not a part of your combo? Or is it is part of like the C combo in the okay. deck. It's, not, right. it's not a main combo run. It's mostly in there because if I have like an arc, uh, you know the one. The yeah. blue guy that has Magecraft. 
Uh, Arc Mage of Emeritus. Arc Mage of Emeritus or a Storm Kiln Artist. Um, it just like makes a bunch of mana arc cards. Okay. And if they runs out, the triggers are doubled, so it's like a ton. And there there is a brain freeze line in this deck, but it's not that good. Then I'm gonna tap one and I'm gonna play Judge's Familiar. It's good. Uh, then I'm gonna pass the turn. I'm tap. I can sack it to try and counter an instant or sorcery unless they pay one. I'm gonna Basically. remove this brain freeze from the equation. Yeah. Um, this always taps for blue. It just makes my board look clunky. Oh, wow. I'd like to gut shot that. Okay. Cool. Um, then I'm going to put a Storm Carve Coast into play tapped and cast Varan with a duality. Pass turn. All right. One tap draw. Yeah. Play a Swamp. Tap two. Play Keen Duelist. And pass. You're always right. going to pick me, right? What? All my spells are one drops. Well, that is true. You know, think about it. <laughs> Here's an underground river. I'm going to go two and play a Talisman of Dominance and pass a turn. Um, I'm going to play... Uh, what are Seven cards in hand. Uh, how many cards do you have in hand, Tarzan? I've got six. How many cards do you have in hand, fully? Six. Someone else has mana rocks. I hate this. Uh -oh. Let me do. What's wrong? We're going to play in Azorius Chancery, picking up the Goblet Shrine. Um, <laughs> and then we're going to pass. It's like he knows about the Windfall in my hand. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, there's a Windfall in my hand. Draw for oh. turn. I don't think I'm going to cast it yet. Um, hmm. Hmm. Let's do an island. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's play Exalted Flamer of St Guy, how do you pronounce this word? Shinek? Zinek? Zinch. Zinch? Exalted Flamer of Zinch. Um, it is a, it's a really cool card from Warhammer 40k. It's a 2-4 with the very popular um, static ability of Sorceress Inspiration. <laughs> Um, at the beginning of your upkeep, return an instant or sorcery card at random from your graveyard to your hand. Wow. And then, uh, Fire of Zinch. Zinch? Zinch. Fire of Zinch. Another very popular uh, static ability. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery, it tends. It deals a damage to each opponent. But right now, the status quo would mean it deals two. Um, I'll tap for it like this. And then, yeah. So we did that. Who uses their life total as a resource more? Everyone with ad nauseum in your deck, raise your hand. I have no idea. You have carnival of souls. It's factually you. I can't hit him. He's got a two power thing. My bear. I don't even want to think about what happens if we trade to this bear amp. You play Bolas of Citadel, right? No, but you can attack me, it's fine. You don't play Bolas of Citadel? No. Alright, well that's a one four that I can't ever get through. Here, take a quick two. Pass her. Untap. Up. Uh, yeah, untap upkeep. Oh man. One drops, like, baby. It's, it, it won't I take mean, shit. You got I'll make it hand. easier for you. This yeah. is your windfall. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you. It's, it's actually me? Yeah. Alright, take time. Oh, it's a one drop. Sorry. Hey, it was a swamp. Swamp. Oh, it's even better for me than it is you. And then draw. Wow. Wow. Coercion at its finest. Swamp. Now, you don't want to interact with me at all because I have one drops. Trust me. We're gonna play Urza's Incubator. Uh, I think we're gonna name Wizard. Yeah, Wizard. You could name Zombie. You could name Zombie. I think Wizard, okay. that's also a Wizard though, so I feel like there might be more. Yeah, there might be more Wizards. And usually Zombie, there's Zombie Wizards, so. Wow. Pass. All right. Sounds like there's a Windfall coming. Oh, I could coming. attack, shit. There, there might be a Windfall be. coming. My hand's really small. I'm not doing so well I guess moment. that means we're gonna go two and get as much stuff out of my hand as possible. Uh, here's a Talisman of Progress, yeah. and then three all colorless. That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. Academy Manufacturer. Ooh. That's a really good yeah. card to play before Windfall happens. Yeah. Uh, that's all I got. Whee. Whee. Um, I'm going to play. We have Ghetto Iden today. Go gang. Can you say um, real gang shit? Oh, uh, shit. Uh, 
Say it in Bosnian. Say real, no, no. Say real <laughs> gang shit in Bosnian for the camera. Real gang shit. <laughs> say it. Come on. They want the the the. Bravo gangster shit. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Can I get a voice clip of you saying that? <laughs> uh, swamp pass. Okay. Upkeep trigger. I'm gonna return a random. This is the only instant sorcery in my graveyard. I'm just gonna put it back. Draw. Okay, um, let's do it like this. Soaring. Makes sense. Is that cool? Yeah. yeah. Hmm, this escalated way quicker than I thought I was going to. Um, Storm Oh, okay. How are you feeling oh. about that? Terrible. You cool with that? No. No, but no. Is it happening? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Moment of silence for our deaths. Alright. Me too. I'm gonna gut shot fully, triggering exalted flamer of uh Zinch. Zinch. Uh twice. And Storm Killer is twice. So I need a treasure. Um can you grab me that? And then I'm gonna hit you, but then this triggers twice. I'm gonna hit one, two, one, two, one, two. Bayran is now gonna be a four four. This is gonna wind up here. I'm gonna have two treasures. Thank you. You want to just use dice over? Yeah, dice is fine. Okay. Did you already do the damage? I did. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna cast Windfall. Same verse. Um, With all the triggers on the stack, yeah. I'm gonna try and single target Cyclonic Rift. I guess the Storm Killer is. That's fine. Uh, I'm going to make three treasures, or two treasures. So that's gonna wind up in my hand. Yeah. And then you're going to take one, two, one, two, one, two, six, six. And we're going to windfall. What's the highest hand size? Six, four. Six, six four, so six. I'll discard. Uh, the windfall is already going to the grave. I had to cast it. And then I'm going to pitch Mental Misstep and Storm Cloud Artist. And I'm now going to draw six cards. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. I'm going to use a treasure. To play Dragon's Rage Shower. I'll pay two life to Gitaxian Pro Calvin. Trigger, 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 trigger. I'm gonna do one, two, one, two, one, two. This is gonna trigger twice. Surveil. Huh. Monkey goes to the graveyard. Surveil. That can stay right where it's at. And then, um, yeah, your hand. We're probing everybody. Calvin probe me, I probe you. Widen, where's your probe? You can't play that. Opposition agent is a really good thing to know is there. Okay, here you go. And I will now draw off of Gitaxian Pro. That goes there. 88. Um, personal tutor. Trigger, 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 trigger. 10, 10. 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2. Survey out before the personal uh, tutor. Definitely grave. Anything that I don't need to immediately cast is just grave. This is creature instant sorcery land. Yeah, this is very delirious. And I'm now going to personal tutor for a copy of Past in Flames. Wow. Isn't that fun? Ah, oh, Past in Flames, how I've missed you. I wish I could get an enchantment so I could get the other flames card. Ariel Flame. Actually, no, I'm just gonna get Faithless Looting. All right. Is that wild? Is that, is that too wild and wacky? Uh, each instant of sorcery card is about to do it. You know, you know, you know. I'm actually just going to get Faithless Living. Um, so all the things have happened. Bayran is what now? A 10-10? Yeah. Yeah, Shire. Yeah. I'll block. I bet. Um, let's put it to the test. Calvin, 10. Iden, 2. It's a 2-4. Yeah. And then, that's it, baby. Pass. Okay. Untap. I'll keep draw. Oh, yeah, I'll keep. Uh, you. <laughs> Three. 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 Look, at, look at you. Just taking bolts. Bolted. Draw. Wow. Wow. Okay. Uh, let's go with a swamp. Surprise. Let's see. Hmm. Just do it. Just do it. A Syriac. We're gonna go into the Mad Mage. Oh my god! I'm the Mad Mage. Life. Real gang shit! <laughs> Here you go. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, and then he's gonna go back to my hand. You're gonna and gain I'm gonna a life. Do it again. Another one. And now we're gonna scry one. Look at that. Oh my god. Do I want this? No one knows. No, I don't. We're gonna bottom that. Uh, he's gonna go back to my hand. And you know what? We're gonna do it again. Another one. So now we get to make a treasure. Yeah, we're gonna make a treasure. Uh, he's gonna go back to my hand. Oh no! And I got you. We're gonna use a swamp and play a strike. Not again! Here we go. Again, scry two. <laughs> oh, that's pretty neat. Uh-huh. Uh, so, is all the time too far as you may play them. You need the mana. You do need the mana. Um, and you have to play them like put, put them both on the stack at the same time. Right, right, right. Do I want both these on top? Yeah, I think I do want both. But... Nah, we're, we're gonna do this one. This one. One top, one bottom? bottom? Yep. Love that. And uh, he's gonna see that lines up in your hand. You can't attack me because I got a 3 3. Alright, but yeah, we can use this treasure. We're gonna catch this. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Real gang shit! And we're gonna make two 1 1s. You wanna chill, man? And we're gonna go have him go back to hand. He can chill in my hand. Are you having a blast? You have to go to discard, right? Yeah. Um, so, from there. I hope everyone loves their new hand. I'm gonna pull back and go to discard. Don't be a was. No attacks here. Hmm. Hmm. You're well, a discard like, and power stone. Adrian, you don't have to actually answer this truthfully, but how close are you to actually just winning? Well, here's the thing about how my deck actually wins uh, all at once. My storm killed artist is involved. Um, the only way that Izzet can actually reanimate a Stormkill Artist, the way my deck's constructed, is Underworld Breach. I'll tell you, I don't currently have it or a way to find it, but if I do, the game is most certainly is with barring interaction, probably just ends on the spot. Okay. I'm gonna play a, a play of planes. Mind you, I can't go get it. I saw Calvin's hand. There is an opposition yeah. agent in it. Um, <laughs> we're just going to add blue, and I'm going to ponder real oh, wait, quick. Isn't it gone now? No. Uh, I oh, I saw it after. But also, video. if I say I'm going to hold up opposition agent, that's Demise. me saying I'm dead. That's True. not putting anything on, into play. True. True facts. Real game shit. Um, I'm going to draw a card of Ponder. Um, My goal is to ride this uh, exalted uh, flamer of Zeech for the rest of the game. I need to have to lose one to one of these two abilities to add blue. Here's a candle keep sage. Real shit. And I'm gonna lose two to add white black and play Warnog. Oh my god. Trigger a bunch of things. I'm gonna make a clue. Wait. No, he makes it all. Yeah, I make it all. But if we give him more clues, he He makes more. More. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> that is such bad news. I'm gonna take a damage. Yeah. Damage. If I took a clue, is there something you can do two mana for to Interact with potentially. I, potentially. Oh, that's oh, I get it. Uh, you know, <sighs> I'm, I'm gonna sign a deal with one devil versus the other. Uh, I'll take a clue. All right. Um, what are the clues? Are they in here? There should be clues in there, but I don't know if there's foods. Uh, which you make. Here's a clue and another clue. Uh, because I've taken a clue. Yeah, I'll take. I'll do that. Um, check it out. This grass is food. And here's treasure. Wow. Oh, here you go. Yeah. Yes. Thank you, Aiden. Yeah. And then also Candle Keep Sage will draw me a card. Okay. Um, that's all I got. Go ahead. Well, I'm gonna untap. I'm gonna draw for turn. The, like, I guess that we found the white source. Yay. Um, here's a Caves of Coils. Uh, what, no. <laughs> what are you talking about? Um, I'm going to play that Skyclave Apparition. Oh. We saw earlier. Beep. Get the left to that. Um, and I am going to target Veyran. Rizzo. Uh, then I'm going to... Sorry. There we go. Then I'm going to pass the turn. 
Untap, Trigger, Exalted, Flamer, Zeke, Zinch. Dim, dim, da, da, da. Three, four, five, six. One, six. One, two, three, four, five. I get personal tutor back. Oh. Ha. Pretty good. Pretty neat. Draw. Okay. Let's do this. Uh, play land. My, my land for turn is Shiv and Reef. Then... Plus four, you cost a, just a whole shitload, huh? One, two, three, four, five, leaving me with four, so I can, yeah, I can afford to put a counter. I'm gonna try to put Bay Ram onto this deck. It's good. It's good? For me, I don't know. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Mr. Tapped Out Black. <laughs> what a sweetheart. Cards in hand full? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Tap for a red. Cast Faith is Living. Trigger everything. Unreal. Twice. It's good. One, two, one, two, one, two, one. It's a really neat card for the graveyard. Two. It's a really cool card for the grave. It just soak these in. Um, and then looting. Is that cool? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, we'll turn a mountain. And personal tutor. There we go. Oh, fully, fully, fully. What are you gonna do to me, man? I don't know. Just be honest, it's fine. You can tell me. <laughs> Eventually you'll tell him, actually. Yeah. I won't snatch. <laughs> yeah. No snitching. Um, yeah, I, I uh, don't trust anybody. 30. Face the Good. Good. Trigger, 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 trigger. One, two, one, two, one, two, one. Ottawara is a good card, but not one I'm interested in now. Two. There is an opposition agent at this table. All right, I will now draw two and discard two. One, two. Maybe you come up. Storm, Marby Stinkin, plus you won't come up. Jewel Lotus. If you, if you come up, I don't, I'm not going to cast it again anyway. Okay, go to combat. Um, this is a mandatory action. Fully have enough flyers, correct? I do not. Three. I'll take three. That's it. Untap. Upkeep. Uh, let's see. Alright. Ooh! I take five. Ew. And you take one. Yeah. Play a super act five times or more. You know, <laughs> yeah, just keep doing it, dude. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna at least do it two more times. Uh, here's a nice super act. Scry three. This is fun. Mm -hmm. I like watching a super act do that. Wow. <laughs> hmm. Is it nuts? Did you find Show the me. I just want to see what it is. <laughs> Good for you. Dude. <laughs> What's the goods? Should it be? No, it shouldn't be this one. Oh god, uh, it's uh, awaken the first while. <laughs> so or nasty. necrotic hex. Each player sacrifices six creatures. You and then I make zombies. Awaken the first while is the funny one. Right, but necrotic hex though. Necrotic hex, though. This is the scry three part? Yeah. And then I get to draw a three on the next one, and then I choose one of them. So I draw them no matter Player what. cast. We're gonna do... Uh, yeah, we're, gonna, we're gonna leave these. You like them all? We like them all. 
And he goes back. Good players try where? Apparently all three to the top. And then Acerac uh, again, and we complete the Dungeon of the Mad Mage. We're gonna draw three. And then oh, we oh, play oh, one oh. of them for free. It's gonna be Necrotic oh, Max. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no. We each sacrifice six creatures. And then he's gonna make a bunch of tap zombies. Uh, so Real uh, gang shit. These all go away. Hmm. Yeah, that's good with me, I think. All right. Uh, updated text for Skyclave Apparition. Um, or for commanders. Um, did I exile that as a replacement, or did it get exiled underneath Skyclave and then I rezoned it? That is important. Uh, typically, the ruling from like imprint, if the card were to leave exile in any way, like this since it's a separate trigger yeah. and not a part of the same effect, I don't see anything in exile when I, I do. See. Got it. And then uh, Academy of Manufacturing will see Warnog leave, right? Yes. No. Well, you're right, but Warnog is gonna have a trigger go on the stack. And by that point, okay, I can't even actually, 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 actually right. see it. All right. Um, by the way, I'll make a clue. Yeah. I, I'm going to draw a card. Do you have two twos? Um, there should be two twos in So you're making a clue? The other one. One through here. Are you making a clue? Check the other file. Oh, I'm going to make a clue. You can have it. All right. And then I have a sheesh. Uh, I'll... Okay. So you so said you're making a clue? I'm making a clue. Okay, so I got six of these. Okay. Continuing my turn now. Ooh. How'd this end up here? Yeah, I had the second. Oh, with the trigger on the stack. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh man. No. Gets... No. It's Does part it of the same. It's same ability. Oh, this goes back to your hand before you actually. Oh, okay. Nice. Okay. Yeah. I thought it was. Already... He's just good. He's just gonna wow. keep raving. So do we just do that? <laughs> we just keep doing that. <laughs> Yeah, you know what? Um, we're mad. We're mad again. Got it. Disco fever is Sarek. <laughs> goes back to my hand. A disco flavor! <laughs> Do it again. Scry. Yeah, yeah, you don't nah, need that. Whatever. And uh, he goes back to my hand. Wow. Uh, and we're gonna go. It's right. Um, and then I'm gonna, I guess, make a treasure. You got it. And he's gonna go back to my hand. You wanna do something with that treasure? Uh, I'm it's filling right. it out. <laughs> filling it out, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna scry to. No one, no one, no one can do it quite like stupid Ace Rack. Imagine yeah. if he had fucking Candle Keep Sage. <laughs> I'm real glad it doesn't have partner. Bought them both. And or choose a background, I guess. Whatever. You know, he's gonna go back to my hand, and we're gonna pass. All right. I guess very. And you got twelve power on play. Yeah. That's a really interesting thing you have going. <laughs> I, I wanted to keep using my exalted flame root zinch. I was having fun. This is my. So I just added that card. Here's. The yeah, I've never card. seen them. It's before. really cool. I like it a lot. It was fun while it lasted. Discard these three, Gaunti, Meteor Golem, Charcoal Den. Interesting. Okay. Right. All right, yes, quite. We're gonna pass the turn. <laughs> quite, yes. <laughs> infinite mana. Untap. Draw stat. For infinite activities. Um, we are going to play this for Fiend's Tower. Hmm. Um, and then we're going to pass the turn. One <laughs> tap, yes. We're going for turn. Mm, indeed. Hmm, quite. Hmm. Mm. Who would count to my spell now? Both of you with all of your that mana, that's all. <laughs> Verena goes seven. They ran the other V command. Verena. <laughs> yeah, Veronica. Don't you wish you had a jewel of this? <laughs> <laughs> I'll punch you on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, hell yeah. Are we just straight gang shit? I mean, I is. You be doing? <laughs> you is. You is. Pack 
incredible. Did you get it? Power of this. It's our strange weird. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> All right. You know what? It's good. All it's right. good. Pass. Good. On there. I'm done. You're done? Yeah. Untap. Draw. This is like the best clue draw I've ever seen in my life. Uh. Oh. Cabal Stronghold. I'm gonna make some mana. Um, How much? So I, I pay, pay three to activate it and tap it. So you tap four lands and make five mana. Yeah. Right now. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Okay, but the question is, do we want to just keep the Acer, I think? Dude, it has been working so far. <laughs> I can't imagine why you'd want to do anything else. Uh, this boy tapped no mana. This boy is holding up cracking clues and uh, casting opposition agent. So instead of taking meaningful game actions, why don't you just grind so much value that it punishes everyone for not doing anything? Let's do that. That yeah. seems great to me. Internet, what would you do? Put in the comments below if you would A, take meaningful game actions, or B, jerk your little Acerac off for like two more minutes. I'm gonna go with that. I, I would go with that too. <laughs> uh, we're gonna add five. Five black. That's, with what? Is but, that a Cabal Stronghold? You yeah, yeah. You little. Uh, so we're gonna use a black. Here he is, Acerac. With that on the stack. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, do I wait? I think you wait. Okay, I'll wait. Colin says to wait. All right, we're waiting. For All right, no so clue. we're gonna go deeper into the dungeons. Here. Storm is at one. We're gonna make two one ones. So. What? Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Uh, so then we're gonna go back to the hand, and we're gonna try it again. He's on the stack again. Fully. Storms at two. <laughs> like, uh, do I, I just wait till he runs out? Uh, he either runs out or presents infinite. Okay, I'll do, I'm good. All right, bet. Scry three. <laughs> He's just gonna keep going. <laughs> what do you do? Uh, oh, wow, okay. Um, that's kind of neat. Do I want that? Mm, maybe. We're gonna, we're gonna keep it there. He's gonna go back to the hand and he's gonna come back. And we're, we're, we're done here. We're gonna draw three. Oh, is that the thing? Yeah, that's the thing. Is that a thing? Carnival of Souls. We're gonna choose to cast that. Or play it, or cast it. What is it? Uh, you have to reveal the other two cards you draw. Yeah. Uh, What's that? First um, of Lock Twain and uh, Liliana's Triumph. Yep. So this is it. This is infinite, right? It do be infinite. Well, it's infinite as long as you have life for it. But I am Wait, choosing to uh, cast one of them without paying, so it is being cast. Um, um, you know. Yeah. Yeah. That's good? Yeah. Okay. Uh, he's going to go back to the hand. Uh, we're going to use a black and we're going to play him and Storms at four. lose a life. With that on the stack. With that on the stack. Thank you, Calvin. And here's seven. Do you sniff it? It's a cyclonic. Overload cyclonic. Storms, Storms at five. five. Right. Priority is now going to start passing around the table, starting with Calvin. I'm good. All right. Yeah. I would like to put Dig Through Time on the stack, triggering Archmage Mirror to Storm is at six. Uh-oh. <laughs> That's what I drew off my clue. I'm going to get rid of Jewel Lotus and not on Aurora, actually. Mountain, not Sokinzan. Island, fuck you, Ragavan. The, this damaged flooded strand, I guess. Um, what else? An offer you can't refuse. That should be six. And then trigger Archmage. And now I would like to pass priority before I can resolve these things. No, no response. Storms at no response from me. None? <coughs> okay. I'm going to draw off Archmage Meridus. And now I'm going to do my favorite thing in Magic the Gathering, which is stare at cards. It's <laughs> <laughs> a pretty good pile, I'm not going to lie. Um, we don't want any lambs. Sorry, guys. I'm going to solve the equation right here. Don't need that. Unnecessary. This card can stay away. So it's U3. Hmm. If I was, would I? Maybe. 
You don't know. I'm gonna take these. You know what, do I even need Pirate of Ritual? Probably not. I'll take these two one drops. All right, after that, continue. Uh, do you have any responses to no. Cyclonic Rift? No. All right. Ba -ba -ba. Ace Rack was on the stack. Ace Rack, ETPs. Um, we are going to stay mad. Gain one life. Um, and then he's going to go back to the end. Yep. Yeah. And then I still had a black floating. No. Yeah, did he? Did. did he? Yeah, I don't know. I definitely did. I don't know how I got moved, but. Sure. Um, sure. Yeah, that's fine. We're just gonna play out Incubator and make Wizard. Yeah, I like that. And pass. Well, I got this card, but... Yeah, you're Foley. Uh, Good job, Foley. I was counting Storm for no reason. There's a meme. Real yeah. quick before it passes my turn. No, nothing. I'll pass it to my turn. Okay. Wow. Tap upkeep. Draw. I hate it. What? Uh, here's a Vault of Whispers. Yeah. Um. Thank you. Not just say. Yeah. I'm just going to move to put Warnog back out. Uh, figuring out what I want to tap. Those four. Leave these untapped. Go colorless, colorless, black, white, and play. Storms at one. Thank you. Clue. <laughs> Anyone else for clues? I'm gonna take a clue. No clues. Okay, so I'll have. But I don't need no clues. That many plus one more. No, you really don't. I took a clue. Oh. You took a clue. So you were at five. Now you're at eight. Thank you. Um. And then Candlebeat Sage will draw me a card. I hate it. It's gonna be fine. Don't freak out so much. <laughs> Out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Holy shit. Come on, man. You know what? I got this. I'm not going to leave Inventor's Fair out for, uh, because Calvin definitely has an opposition agent, I heard. I heard so I'm going to lose a room. One to Spire of Industry to play an Agent of the Iron Throne. Storm to two. Ooh. Oh, that's a thing that says I found that. Yep. I am done. Go ahead. Hold on. Okay. I am going to tap for a blue. Um, hold, floating the white. I'm gonna play Swan Song. Ooh. Counter that in jam. Storm's yeah. at three. You good? You get a two two. Um, uh, that is all I have for my turn. Go ahead. Before the mana goes away, we'll just get that hop agent out. Yeah. And then we'll untap. Storm was at four. Now it's at zero. Draw for turn. Um, we will play Takanuma. You ban Meyer as my land for turn. Yeah. Um, let's see here. Let's see here. Oh, I'm so full. Um, we are going to. Yeah. What stops I from just like? I got nothing. Man, um, interaction stops me. Man. I am on a black now, like, I'm, I might have the Imp's Mischief. Pimp's Mischief? Pimp's Mischief, yeah. <laughs> I'm staring at five lands, I don't know. Good, good. Oh, I'm not. Okay. Oh, shit. None of these are lands. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna play Rafine. Yeah, oh yeah. Um, and then we're going to enter combat. You got it. I'm gonna have my 3-2 commit item. Uh, mm -hmm. Connive trigger. I'm gonna draw a card. Targeting the opposition. Is that fine? Yeah. yeah. It could be one more. We'll see. Yeah. Draw a card, then discard a card. Uh, let's say we discard this hopeful uh, doodad, which is not a land. You take one. Ta da. And we're there. And then. We don't have. 
what, what, no, that doesn't, that doesn't do it. Okay, um, we are going to tap this blue, and we are going to play this Mystic Remora. Yeah. And we will pass the turn. Okay. We'll draw. Hmm. I have the means to stop Iden in my deck. I can't go get it. We'll see how this plays out. Great. First, I'm going to start by allowing Calvin to draw every card in his deck. Mox. Okay. We. Soaring. Okay. We. Oh, what are you pitching to Mox? This Tandem Lord. Oh, okay. Arcane Signet. Okay. We. Let's see if Calvin wants to lose. Bolt Opposition Agent. Okay. We. Um. We're gonna pay two life mental mist up. Sure. I will pass the turn. I have draw. Uh, we're gonna play a swan. Let's see. Um, we're gonna spend three here and play Ayara first uh, of Lock Twain. Yeah. So everybody's gonna lose one, I'm gonna gain one. Boop. And then... He's gonna pass a turn. Oh, yeah. Uh, we're gonna activate this for six. Yep. I'm gonna use two of it and go for a Carnival of Souls. I have nothing. I will crack a single e. singular clue. That's a treasure. Oh, you're using a treasure. Card. You're good. Go ahead. We didn't find it. Okay. Uh, we're gonna use a black to play a Serac. Yep. So Things are gonna happen. Yeah. So how does it actually win? So on ETB, he triggers. This triggers. You're all gonna lose one life. I'm gonna gain one, and I'm gonna lose one. So this is gonna net zero. zero. Okay. But I get the black man. Okay. <laughs> and you have three floating. Yeah. So I gotta do it. Let you do it at least once. Hmm? Um, What's the interaction? Swords of Plowshares. It does not help. Swords of Plowshares can exile the lady. Um, yeah. Which is gonna stop him from gaining like. Oh, it puts, the a, it puts a limit on the number of times you can do it. He'll yeah. find a it different, is. and you would do it before uh, the Astrak actually enters the battlefield. So before yeah, she triggers. Yeah, do it now on the stack to minimize the amount of times yeah. you can do it. So yeah, I'm gonna crack this treasure. And swords the Ayara. Put him at 20. Why did we all gain life? Oh, because this happened before the Aesirac. Okay, so Aesirac ETBs. Uh, I'm gonna lose one life and get a black. Yeah. Uh, and then trigger. I scry one. Uh, bottom. And he's gonna go back to the hand. And yeah. we're gonna keep doing this. That's all swords, I'll have to draw a card. Until I complete a dungeon, so we're gonna go uh, use use one. So you keep on using the one you get from Carnival yeah, Souls? And then, yeah, and uh, then... And that's... The you can leave your AC record in play. Now yeah, now we can yeah. Represent your casting it again by ticking down one life. We'll make a treasure. Okay, and then we're gonna cast it again. Uh, and it's gonna be the Scry 2 now. Oh, do I want this? No. Okay, uh, we're gonna do it again. Uh, we're gonna make two dudes. Uh, do it again. You lose two life from two dudes entering play. Oh yeah, you're right. So we get the mana. You would still get the mana, but let's just exile the top two. Yeah, let's just exile the top two. My bad. So these are exiled Urbor, Tomb of Yagmoth, and Fleshbag Marauder. Okay, um, we're gonna do it again. Yeah. Scry three. What the hell was this? <laughs> right? Uh, actually though, is that Demonic Tutor? Maybe. 
No, that's Tendrils of Agony. Tendrils of Agony. Oh, oh. Yeah. Lit. Okay. Well, shit. How many times have we... Oh, the one time I mean didn't count Storm. <laughs> um, so you just dropped Carnival, right? You played Carnival, he played Swords, and... Carnival, Swords, Rack, Rack, Rack. We, I think we're at five. Yeah, I started, I mean, we, I started the dungeoning at, I was already in this. The first room? So yeah. you played Rack four times? This is your fourth time playing it? So we're yeah. at six. So we're at six. As lose, a target player loses two life, you gain two life. Yeah. Yeah. Storm. We're gonna keep that on top, bottom of these, and we're gonna do it again. We we'll complete the dungeon now. Draw three. Oops. You reveal your draws? Yeah, you reveal the draws. Liliana, well, Tendrils of Agony plus Bubbling Muck. Can you cast all of them or just one? You can cast one for free. Probably Tendrils. For free? Well, yeah. I can cast Tendrils after I storm a little more. Do we have the mana? You're at four. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe so, you cast Muck. I don't know. No, because we have no land style. It's just Liliana. I see. Liliana. Yeah. Hmm? You casting Lily? Yeah. Got it. He has enough mana to cast Tendrils. Yeah. You can just cast Tendrils so we can get Storm higher. Yeah. Okay. Um, so. And if he couldn't, he could he could absolutely like make the two dudes out of yeah. X go around. If only I could could have gone to go get a braid. That was a mint. Okay, so now we're gonna just go with. Can she reanimate? No, no, she can't. Uh, okay, so now we're gonna cast him again. Uh, we could go back to gaining life. Uh, oh, yeah. And then do it again. Scry. Bottom. We'll lose a life. Do it again. Number three. Make treasure. Yeah. yeah, right there here. Oh, yeah, thank you. And then lose a life. Do Just try to. That won't do anything. We're gonna lose a life. Uh, now we exile the top two, I guess. Uh, soul Shatter and Swamp. Okay, we're gonna lose a life. Scry three. <laughs> <Pretty bad. laughs> wow. Uh, Bottom two, top one. Where would all your zombies go? What happened to those? They Cyclonic Rift. That's right. Uh, so we're gonna lose a life, complete the dungeon. Draw three, reveal them. Army of the Damned, Mirage Mirror, Liliana. But you can't cast Army. You will die. Yeah, I would die. Yeah. So we're gonna draw that. Um, let's see. Mirage Mirror, pay two. Mirage Mirror becomes a copy of target artifact, creature, or enchantment of the it can become a copy of the Cabal, Cabal Stronghold, and you have the mana. Yeah, makes more mana. Oh, this is just hand. Okay. You now so have enough to Tendrils and kill Calvin and Foley. To get to me, you need to cast eight more spells. Eight more spells, mm -hmm. which we th might be able to do. Let's see. Just fucking for this. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Eight more spells, eight more spells. Without killing yourself, obviously. Right. Because it is right well, now. I mean, the last two can be like non creature spells, I guess. Yeah. If I have the mana. Uh, so lose a life, uh, gain a life, uh, then lose a life, scry one, bottom, and then we're gonna lose a life and make a treasure, and then we'll lose a life and scry two. Lose a life. Uh, exile the top two. Decree of Annihilation and Bomb Two's Monument. Nice. Uh, we're gonna cast Bomb Two's Monument. It's, it's another life gainer. Yep, you have four floating right now? Yeah. Yep. Okay. Uh, you draw a card off, you cast in that, and that still doesn't do it. At this point, nothing does it. Net zero? Uh, yeah, you're net zero right now. And everybody's losing life at the yep. same time. That kills us. Kills you guys. Man. A Syrax pretty good, huh? <laughs> wow. Why now I remember why we don't do that that often. <laughs> hey, thank you guys so much for watching, as always. Tendrin?